Welcome to DX Sudoku training video number three. In this video, the basic technique, hidden single, will be discussed. Consider the following Sudoku in progress. When looking for a hidden single, for each number we highlight all the remaining candidates. We are now showing cells highlighted all having a possible one candidate. To find a hidden single, we are looking for a house with only one remaining possible candidate of a particular number. For the house making up row 1, there are three possible one candidates along the row. So there are no hidden singles in row 1 for the number 1. There are three possible ones on row 3, three possible ones on row 8, and only two possible ones on row 9. No rows have any hidden singles. Next, we look at columns. For column 1, we have four possible ones. Column 3 has three possible ones. Column 5 has two. Column 9 has two. No columns have any hidden singles. Next, we consider blocks. Block 1 has four possible ones. Block 2 does not have any. Block 3 has two. Block 4, 5, and 6 have none. Block 7 has three. Block 8 has 2, and Block 9 has none. No block has any hidden singles. So out of the 27 possible houses, no house has any hidden singles for the number 1. We repeat the process of looking for hidden singles for each number. The Sudoku is now showing all the possible 2 candidates highlighted. For the number 2, row 1 has 3 candidates. Row 2 has 4 candidates, row 8 has 4 candidates, and row 9 has 3, so there are no hidden singles on the rows. We continue for each column. Column 1 has 4 candidates, column 3 has 3, column 7 has 3, and column 8 has 4, so there are no hidden singles in the columns. Next, we continue for each block. Block 1 has 4 possible candidates. Block 2, 4, 5, 6, and block 7 have none. Blocks 3 and 7 have 3 candidates, and block 9 has 4. There are no hidden singles contained in any block. Next, we continue the process of looking for hidden singles. The Sudoku is now showing candidate locations for number 3 highlighted. We see each row for the 3 candidate has more than one possibility. We also see each column for the 3 candidate has more than one possibility. And we see each block for the three candidate has more than one possibility. So there, is, there are no hidden singles for the three candidate. Next, we continue the process of looking for hidden singles. The Sudoku is now showing locations highlighted containing a possible four candidate. Immediately, when we scan row three, we see the house making up block two only has one possible four candidate. We see row 2, column 5, has a hidden single for the 4 candidate, since the cell also has a 3 and a 5 as possible candidates. We also see row 3, column 3, cell, has only one possible 4 in the house making up row 3. The house making up block 2 must have at least one 4, so we choose 4 as the value. We now see the house making up block 1 and the house making up row 3 have only one possible 4 candidate hiding in row 3, column 3 cell. We choose 4 as the value. Next, consider the following Sudoku in progress. We begin the process of looking for hidden singles by highlighting all the cells having a 1 for a possible candidate. We see each row for the 1 candidate has more than one possibility. We also see each column for the 1 candidate has more than one possibility. And we see for each block the 1 candidate has more than one possibility. So there are no hidden singles for the 1 candidate in this Sudoku. Next, we continue the process of looking for hidden singles. The Sudoku is now showing locations highlighted containing a possible 2 candidate. We start scanning for hidden singles and we find the block 1 has a hidden single and row 3 has a hidden single for the 2 candidate. 
We choose the number 2 for the two cells, having a hidden single for the number 2. The house making up block 1 must have at least one number 2, and the house making up row 3 must also have at least one number 2 to complete the puzzle. Next, consider the following Sudoku in progress. We begin the process of looking for hidden singles by highlighting all the 1 candidates. We see each row, column, and block having more than one possible 1 candidate, so there are no hidden singles for the number 1. Next, we highlight the 2s. We see each row, column, and block have more than one possible 2 candidate, so there are no hidden singles for the number 2. Next, we highlight the 3s. For each row, column, and block have more than one possible 3 candidate, so there are no hidden singles for the number 3. Next, we highlight the 4s. For each row, column, and block have more than one possible 4 candidate, so there are no hidden singles for the number 4. Next, we highlight the 5s. For each row, column, and block have more than one possible 5 candidate, so there are no hidden singles for the number 5. Next, we highlight the 6s. We immediately see 3 hidden singles in blocks 2, 4, and 9. We select the 6 as the values for the hidden single cells. This immediately shows another hidden single in block 6 for the number 6. We select the 6 as the value for the hidden single in block 6. All the 6s are now complete for every house in the puzzle. Before we begin testing, please make sure to click on the link below and make a generous donation so we can continue making DX Sudoku videos. Time to test what you have learned. Consider this Sudoku in progress. We will now show you each set of candidates highlighted. Look for any singles. Consider all the possible four candidates again. Pause the video before continuing so you can look for the hidden single. We find a hidden single on row 4, column 4. We choose the value 4 for the cell. Consider all the possible five candidates again. Pause the video before continuing so you can look for the hidden single. We find a hidden single for the number 5 in block 8. We choose the value 5 for the cell in block 8, and we find another hidden single for the number 5 in block 9 as a result. We choose the value 5 for the cell in block 9. Next, consider all the possible 8 candidates again. Pause the video before continuing so you can look for the hidden single. We find a hidden single for the number 8 in block 2. We choose the value 8 for the cell in block 2. Next, consider the following Sudoku in progress. We will show you each set of candidates highlighted. Look for any hidden singles.
Consider all the possible two candidates again. Pause the video before continuing so you can look for a hidden single. We find a hidden single for the number two in the house making up row two. We choose the value two for the cell in row two. Please support DXadoku so we can continue making DXadoku training videos. To make a donation, click on the DXadoku channel link below. Then click on the Donate to DXadoku button to make a donation with PayPal or credit card. Thank you for your generous donation and support. This completes DXadoku training video number three. Thank you for watching.